with the spectators and whoever has been involved with CC, they've had a great time. So Hill Khan, the team owner of Mumbai Heroes, that's Mr. Shaji, the owner of the Kerala Strikers. Even though their side is not here in the finals, they're all there to witness this final game and to support CCL. And it's been incredible. We are playing at a neutral venue. And you can uh, see the crowd's response. They have built up here. Crowd has swelled as the game has progressed. And they've witnessed some uh, superlative batting skills. In the first innings, it was from Vikrant. And some good bowling effort also from Bulldozers. But this is a crunch situation for uh, Bulldozers here. A misfield. Will it go all the way? It has the pace. Yes, it does. Good wrist work uh, from Baskar outside of them. He just flicked it uh, on to the bats on striker. And he completely messed it up. Off to a great start, Karnataka Bulldozers. Now that Rajiv has uh, gone back to the pavilion, the onus shifts to Baskar He's out there in the middle. He is a guy who likes to rotate the strike, plays uh, quite authentic cricket shots. Everything now shifts to him. He'll have to shoulder this responsibility. They're doing, they're doing quite well. They have lost the wicket of the big man, uh, Rajiv. But if you look at the run rate, that's pretty okay now. 8.45. The required rate uh, is 8.02, so they are uh, ahead of that. That's not an issue. They need to have wickets in hand and build partnerships. Good shot, the great fielding. They need to get closer to the target and they can do so, if they can do so, without losing too many wickets. They always have a chance of uh, achieving uh, a target of 162. Well, that was uh, neatly struck by uh, Bhaskar. He equally well fielded uh, in the cover region. After four.